Hey, I'm James from J Technology, and we are back here at day four at CES 2016 at the Sands Convention Center. We're here at the Bixie booth, and we have uh, Robin Zank. He is uh, head of sales, and he's going to go over what this uh, gesture device is all about. Robin? Hello. How are you doing? Good. All right. So what we got here is Bixie. The world's first portable gesture recognition device that allows you to control any of your smart devices that are Bluetooth or Wi-Fi compatible without actually touching them. If I give you a quick demo, for example, this Big C, we connect it through the Philips U light, for example. Without touching it, you can turn it on and off. You change the colors by just casually swiping over. And you see it's very easy, right? You don't actually have to learn many gestures. You can control the intensity of the light, and all this without touching it. Nice. So the idea behind it is, for example, you're cooking, all right? You got your recipe on the iPad. It works on all operating systems. Now you got your recipe on the iPad, for example. It goes to sleep mode after 60 seconds. So instead of stopping to cook, washing your hands, coming back, entering your pink code, you use Pixie. So what you do, you swipe over, you unlock it. Also with the passcode, which we, of course, previously authorized through the phone app. And then we can continue browsing through a recipe without touching anything. So when your hands are uh, dirty or wet, you can have two modes active at the same time. You can either have two different devices or two different apps on the same device. Here, for example, next to the browsing, what we got is the music mode, meaning I swipe twice over uh, the big C. Now I'm in the music mode, and I start playing my music. Since it's a little noisy here, and you might not really hear the music, I'll show you in the music mode. So now you're in the music mode, where you can uh, start and stop your music. The same gestures apply intuitive gestures, meaning you know your next song's to the right, where you would swipe on your iPad as well. So you swipe to the right. The same gesture, what applied here with the intensity, applies here, controlling the volume. Meaning, we, have, we kept it down to eight simple gestures so that you don't get a dictionary full of gestures and have to learn them before using them. But Bixi notices to what kind of device or app it is connected. Meaning the same movement what we got here for the intensity of the light, Bixi notices here, it doesn't make sense to increase the light when you're in the music mode, so the same gesture applies to the volume. Then another use case we would have, if you want to step over here, we, uh, for GoPro users, GoPro users might know the struggle. When you start, for example, you've got your GoPro on your helmet, right? So you, when you start, you press play and to record everything you see. If it's interesting or not, and you're wasting a lot of storage, a lot of battery life, and it's impossible to control your camera up there. So with Pixie, you can ride your bike, you swipe over it with your thumb, you can uh, turn on and off your camera, you take a picture, you switch to the video mode, or you take a burst shot. And all this without actually touching it and not getting too distracted. The same when you're on your bike, and you're not necessarily using a GoPro, but you're just listening to your phone. It's hard while riding your bike, getting your phone out, you get distracted. So instead of this, you control your music or anything you wish to control. And for this, we uh, have the app of Bixie, because Bixie itself works with Bluetooth. But using the phone as a bridge allows you to connect to either Bluetooth or Wi-Fi devices. So here, for example, we have the Philips Ulight active right now. Here we got a set of pre-configured applications and devices from which you choose whatever you want to control at the moment. And this is, also, of course, only a pre-configured set. And down here, you got the customize button where you can control any device you got. Meaning, you, um, you get in your car, for example, that you can connect to Bluetooth or Wi-Fi or any other device. Blue the phone scans which Bluetooth sources are around and then allows you to connect your Bixi to it with the same gestures and Bixi figures what gestures apply. And the same gestures used with any of your device Bixi will send the respective command. Wow, that's pretty nice. Um, and they come in different colors too? And Yes. Um, when, when you're ordering it, you can choose from different colors. The silicon ring here, you can easily remove and change it, uh, change the colors. Also, this is a prototype, right? So it will look a lot neater. It will be available. The white ring can be in different colors. There will be an aluminum version as well. And the colors, you can change them every day. However, when you're, for example, on your GoPro, for outdoor usage, we got Gorilla Glass 4 on there. If you're, for example, outdoor, you choose a color, a little darker color, so that it doesn't get too dirty, for example. If you're in the office giving a presentation, you choose, for example, the aluminum ring with a decent, elegant color. And yeah, you can customize your Big C however you wish. And I noticed you got a uh, CES award? 
Yes, luckily uh, last Tuesday we were awarded uh, the, uh, the uh, top pick of the CES here. Nice, very nice. Um, price and availability. We will start our Kickstarter in three weeks this February, where uh, you can get it for between fifty-five, sixty-five dollars. And when we start shipment this September, it will be available for around ninety, ninety-nine dollars. Okay. And we will announce all these prices on our website. It's basically just one model, different colors you can choose from. Exactly. Um, there will be different versions and then all the colors that doesn't cost anything extra. Like because you choose your color and then attach it however you feel, whatever you wish at this at one day. Well thank you, Robin. Thank you very much. Have a great day.